Okay, so now I'm going to finish eating my Cornish hen from the other day. I ha have made this recipe to be opposite from what it normally is. Typically, the, the chicken is hot and the bread is cold, right? So this is my Indian fried bread. And I'm hiding what's underneath because I did take a bite into the chicken from before. It is very well seasoned. I'm eating it as if it were a cold cut. And that's why I'm eating it cold because cold chicken that's well seasoned tastes really, really, really good. You should try it one day. And so I'm just garnishing it, uh, showing you that it has peppers and cilantro and all that. Just, just, just for garnishing. But this chicken, this Cornish hen, and this fried bread, I'll take a piece of it right now. I just finished frying it. Okay. Mmm. Wow. Okay. I mean, it's the batter I made for a pancake, so of course it's going to taste good, right? But I stuffed it also with peppers, onions, and cilantro. And um, typically I like to fry things in um, sesame seed oil. It gives it a nice boost in the flavor. But I figured I want to taste it without it first. But this, this is really, really good bread, actually. It's like eating pancake. You make, you make Indian fried bread very similar to the way you make your, your, your pancake mix. Um, it is delicious. I put butter in it as well into the mix. Mmm. Doesn't taste like, like pancake at all. I fried it lightly and I'm ready to go. Thank you for watching and have yourself a happy new year. Bye now. Oh, by the way, it's my birthday.